Lotus Theme Park is located in Sihung City, Jonggi Province. Right next to it, there is government office called Gwangokji managing lotus flowers and ponds during the Joseon Dynasty in Korea. Especially, at this government office called Gwangokji, Korean ancestors began to grow lotus flowers for the first time in Korea. For a long time, in this area, there had been a famous pond making lotus flowers grow under natural environments composed of moisture-rich lipids and capable of creating a large pond. This area has these geological characteristics. With these geological characteristics and with clear air and abundant sunlight, not only lotus flowers, but many other flowers are also growing, at about 30 ponds of various sizes. In fact, in each pond, there are various types of lotus flowers growing up well. The sacred lotus of the Egyptians, which blooms along the Nile River, is a water lily, and the lotus eaten by the lotus eater in Greek mythology is a yellow variety. The Indian lotus is a kite in an ancient Indian folklore, it symbolizes female reproduction and represents fertility, strength and the creation of life. It is also a symbol of abundance, good luck, prosperity, longevity, health, and honor, or is a symbol of the earth and its creative power, divinity, and immortality. In India, a statue of a lotus goddess estimated to be around 3000 BC was discovered, and in the scriptures of Brahmanism. There is a record that this goddess was born standing on a lotus flower and wearing a lotus flower. With the advent of Buddhism, the lotus flower is said to have bloomed to announce the birth of Buddha, and it was believed that in Buddhism's paradise, all believers are born as gods on lotus flowers. In India, Lotus flowers are offered to various gods and the gods are seated on lotus flowers or held in their hands, and in Buddhism, a custom of Buddha statues or monks sitting on lotus pedestals arose. In China, even before the spread of Buddhism, the image of the lotus flower growing cleanly in the mud was expressed as the flower of a gentleman untainted by the worldly world. And the reality of many seeds growing was considered a sign of fertility. Buddhism, which came to China, thought that the world of paradise was a pond where sacred lotus flowers grew, and began to build ponds within temple grounds.